Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new save file. We are jumping in again and the streak. Ooh, the streak, baby. It's going well. Um, What do we want to do? Do we want to play as an existing tainted character or do we want to unlock a new one? Um, We did try and go for Bethany the other day. We should probably do that again. I still want to unlock tainted Jake Benizo. By the way, I didn't mention it on previous episodes, but this person that said they'd get a tattoo if I beat the run... They are holding up their end of the bargain, and there is currently a thread on my Discord for voting for what tattoo they'll get, because they, they, they let people vote on it, and there are some wacky designs out there, so go and vote on those, if that's still going. I, I think it should be. I think it'll end in a few days. Could also play as Henry. Um, We unlocked Tainted Job recently, didn't we? I'm pretty sure we've unlocked Tainted Job. Let's give it a go. I'm pretty sure we've unlocked Tainted Job. If not, it'll just default us to regular Job, and we can play as regular Job. I'm pretty sure we got this character unlocked, and I thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed this character. This character is crazy. Basically, uh, you start with pretty low HP. Every item is Damocles. Everything's doubled. Everything is doubled. But, at the end of each floor, you lose like 30% of the items you picked up on the last floor. So you don't get to keep everything. But... You can use um, Deus Custodia in order to lock an item in, but it will give you a broken heart when you do so. So there's a lot of risk, uh, but a lot of potential reward. You also do start with a rotten heart as well, which just helps with your DPS a little bit. Because it's not a bad DPS at all. You've got exactly Isaac's stats, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, this character is really interesting. and can get really kind of nutty. Um... So, in this situation here, we got Pop and we got the Keeper's Annoying Fly. Blocks both enemy projectiles and Isaac Tears. Deals more contact damage to enemies the more tears it absorbs in the current room. Intriguing. I think I'm just going to take both of these. I don't like the idea of it blocking my own tears. Uh, let me just... I want to see. Okay, yeah. It's, it's actually not that bad. It's hitbox isn't that bad. And then pop is fine. I wouldn't say either item there is one that I'd be looking to keep forever. Uh, as for the question of the day today, what's your biggest motivation at the minute? What's something you're really motivated to do or like, you're really motivated to get done sort of thing? What's your biggest motivation right now? As some of you might already know, uh, for me it's recently been weight loss. I've been on a pretty, pretty kicking weight loss journey over the past like, Four months. Basically, I started dieting the start of um, the start of January, and I have to say, I'm very proud of myself. I've done a lot better than I would have thought. Um, I've lost like 13 kg now, which is like um, three stone almost, which I'm, I'm really happy about. I'm feeling a lot, lot, lot better, dude. This we could die here. We gotta be careful. In fact, that was a fucking terrible, terrible bomb right there. Yeah, this guy could super easily kill me. And he did super easily kill me. The streak. The streak. He he telegraphs his little beam quite fast. Like, it gives you time to know it's coming, but I, it's, it's hard to dodge. Either way. We didn't get great items there. It's fine. But yeah, I've, um, I've been doing pretty well with it. I've been sticking to it. Um, I still have my cheat days. I still have, like, a, a cheat day, like, once a week so that I can... Basically expel all the cravings out of my body. Because, like, I think the worst thing when you're dieting or trying to lose weight is you just get, like, mad cravings for stuff that you just can't eat. Um, this is good. Number two. It's a weird one, but I'm going to lock number two in. I, I think number two is actually fantastic. It's literally infinite bombs for the rest of the run. And early game, it's quite a good bit of damage. Quite a good bit of damage indeed. And it's also super, super easy to, like, stop and start it whenever you want. I think people that don't like it, I'll be honest, I feel like those people just don't really get how it works. Um, Because if you... So, if, for example, I hold fire and it's like one, two, three... It's like three seconds and it fires. If I keep holding fire now, it will never poop again. If I let go and then start firing again... Then three, two, one. There you go. Fires another poop. But you fire the one poop. I could, I could literally fire a poop in this room. Leave it. Hold fire down. Go into the next room. And even in this room, it won't drop another poop. Until I let go of the fire button, it will not drop another one. There you go. I let go of it again. 
and it will drop a poof there. And it's just, I, I feel like people just don't, either don't know that or don't pay attention to it enough. It makes the item infinitely more usable than people think it is. I think it's such a good item. Such good damage. The fact that it's mass room damage as well is kind of insane. Like, look at that. They just killed all of those guys. Just, it's, it's awesome. It's such a damn good item. Um, don't know if I can get to that dime in any way, shape, or form. Very much like to, but... Do you know what? I, I have to give it back up to 800. I've been bullying the hell out of my donation machine, and I feel bad about it. I'm also going to try and find my secret room here, which at the minute, I'm currently not so sure where that is. Killed you. Good, good, good. Right. Also got a Tango Apple here. Very happy to have it. It is truly one of the most blessed things that you can drink on this earth. Right. Good, good, good. Secret room. Lots of cards. Unfortunately, just this is a predefined room with just all teleport cards, which is not great for us. But it might take a bit of time, but we get to blow up all of these fires for free. No cost to us. I think our best course of action is to take the um, take the stars card to save a key, potentially. Boom. Oh. A good bit of damage, but didn't quite kill the guy I was hoping it would. Right. I am taking my time here, and I realise it's a little bit annoying to watch, but... I want to get these blown up and uh, dealt with, because there's a lot to yield from these. Whenever the spy doesn't need to just walk out the room, walk back in. Hopefully, we can get a bit of money or a quarter out of this. If all goes well. Come on, spiders, why? Why do you have to exist? Luckily, when I plant another bomb, it kills all the spiders in the room, so... It kind of... It's a problem that somewhat deals with itself, I'll be honest. Okay, there you go. Everything is done. Dude, spiders, can you not please. Right, let's check the second secret room now. I honestly doubt it's here, but i got to check it. There as well. A bit of a slow play on this floor here, but it's fine. I don't mind doing my due diligence to find the uh, extra stuff that I can. Should probably try and find the crawl space as well, but that would take quite a bit of time. I don't know if I have the patience for that. Good. We at least get a free hug out of this guy. Is it worth playing you? Nah, it's worth bombing you both, though. Look at all these goodies. Beautiful stuff. Right. Yeah, did a good bit of damage to you there. A little bit of damage. And we get the stun as well. Look at that. Beautiful. And we get Pentagram and Steven. Unfortunately, we can't lock either of those in, but still both are good. I think we will lose one of these, though. I'm I'm hoping it's Steven, to be honest, out of all of them. Go down. Not Pentagram, not Pentagram, not Pentagram, not Pentagram. Okay, the dog heads. Oh, we lost Pentagram. No. <laughs> it's fine. Oh, baby, I love your way. Um, Well, I think we have to lock in Hurst Hat, definitely. This is kind of tricky, because I kind of want to lock in both of those. Definitely want to lock in Hurst Hat, because that completely nullifies the possibility of us accidentally hitting ourselves with the bombs, which is not super likely anyways for me, but it completely nullifies any possible chance of that happening, so. Grab 
that. Weld is pretty good for the next floor. Almost got a Deus Custodia charge going. Damn it! A little bastard. The way that they move freaks me out. Okay. I'm over here. Deus Custodia that. I'd like to Deus Custodia that as well, but I, I think it's highly unlikely we're going to get the ability to get a charge for that. But I will definitely try. I will definitely try. Uh, clears the room of every grid pick up an enemy. Rooms cleared using the skip card. Do not contribute to active item charges. No drop rewards. Can also skip boss rooms at the cost of no item. Um, can be used against final bosses to skip phases, excluding final phase. Interesting. All pickups chests into... Okay, that's pretty good. We'll use that in the next room. What the fuck are they? What are these little things? What the hell? That's soul heart. Yeah. yeah. I don't know what these little things are, but strange. I guess, I guess I'll hold on to this card and see how long I end up keeping it for. It seems pretty interesting to be able to skip final phases of bosses. Like, not, well, any phase of boss, as long as it's not the final phase, sorry. Um, it looks like we're not going to get another uh, thingy, so let's just take our active and hope for the best. We'll at least get one heart out of it. I just hope we can get more than one. Right. Do the boss. Do it to it, Captain. Sales with grid. What the fuck? They've got names. Strange. Love rooms like this with butt bombs, because everything just dies. <laughs> like, pretty much everything. So satisfying. We are on two broken hearts now. You guys should be getting pretty weak. I know you guys are going to jump around like crazy. Oh, it's just so satisfying with these weaker enemies in the early floors. I don't know why people wouldn't lock in butt bombs. That's pretty good. Tears with chance base effects gain herming in a significant size increase. Right now it's not super useful, but could be in the future. Great stuff here. What did our shop include item-wise? I don't think it was anything good, was it? I would have remembered if it was anything good. Um... We got Yik Heart, which is a Morbid Heart on use. I guess I'll just take a Morbid Heart here. And the other item is unobtainable, unfortunately. I'd like it, but <laughs> it's in a position where it is impossible for us to grab it. Because there isn't meant to be two items there. The game didn't account for that. All of you go, please. Beautiful. I didn't find second secret room, but that's kind of fine. Go back to wherever our boss is. I'm unsure exactly where that is, I'll be honest. Did I just deflect that needle there with a bomb? Pretty funny. Right. Boss, boss, where are you? Where are thou? Let's just check the shop again, because I mean, I might as well. Shop items can be purchased even if unaffordable. Debt gives a multiplicative damage down, drops a credit card on pickup. I'm going to pick that up just because it gives us a credit card. Um, and honestly, I like the skip card, but it's going to be too annoying to hold on to it forever. I'm just going to hold the credit card. I can use real bombs here because I've got infinite butt bombs. Good items here. Try and go for Angel Deal. And we'll see what we lose in the next floor. Keep this going. What am I hoping to lose? 
Not too bad. Lots even stapler. Not too bad. There are that. You guys will be weak. Indeed you are. Didn't really need to put that bomb down there. Whoopsie. Aha! You're all dead. <laughs> Fools. It's going well. It's going well. I do like having the dad hat on as this character. It's pretty funny. I want to get a chance based effect to go with my um, with my trinket. Imagine getting fruitcake where like everything's a chance based effect. We get herming on everything. Make this trinket amazing. Even three dollar bill would be like real good. Walked right into that one quite literally. Right, got another one of those going. Okay, I feel like we'll be days custodiating that as well. We now have Ipecac plus Hurst Hat. I feel like that's a pretty good combo. Now, I gotta admit, this makes Butt Bombs quite useless because we can no longer really effectively charge. Um, but, I've gotta say, I'm pretty happy with Hurst Hat plus Ipecac. Gotta say. Don't think there's any qualms or worries about that fact. So now we have a lot of damage. Unfortunately, no herming with this. This doesn't count as a tier effect. But this is this is a pretty awesome setup to get going. In fact, um, we uh, we can probably get away with not Deus. Um, custodiering any more items and probably be pretty much fine. I would expect. Like, this this two-item combo is pretty much um, run-winning. Probably just want the soul heart here, but... The drummer thing is pretty good, too. I'll see if I get the money for it. I don't want to jump the gun. Oh no, an explosion. What am I ever going to do? <laughs> We've also reached max HP here as well. Close. I love the fact that Ipecac poisons as well, because they don't die to the explosion, they damn well die to the poison. We'll get rid of that tier there. Oh wait, I have credit card. I can get the toy drum if I want. I just realised. Although, should I try and go for a shop with more purchasable items in it? Maybe. Speed and the stern. Let's have a little look-see. Let's have a little look-see. Maybe what I'll do is I'll buy the drum. And then I'll destroy this. And unfortunately... Mm, don't really want to use my credit card on that stuff. Okay. Almost good to go. I, I, I still ought to do the rest of the floor here. Just in case there's something crazy. You never know. But yeah, having Toy Drum to up our damage by that much every now and again seems fun. I'm trying to like make sure I don't bomb myself, but it legitimately doesn't matter. At all. I should probably bomb into my uh, cash room here just in case. Good stuff with the black hearts there. I like that. Fortunately, not immune to the poison damage. So I can't just stand next to mushrooms. Don't care for the pill. Good, and we get another charge of this. I think this is the last charge of prayer card I'm going to bother using, and therefore I'm going to go and grab the book instead. Just because we've got plenty of red hearts now. So let's go, 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 go. Right. Just in case I checked it and I was correct. Correct a Mundo. Right, next floor. Let's go. Okay, what items are we going to lose here? I'm hoping we lose the stern. I'm hoping we don't lose Toy Drum. We will lose Toy Drum and Torn Furter. Probably the two worst ones we could have lost, but hey-ho, what's done is done. 
it really doesn't matter that much. She got herself a Gigabomb. Nice. That is a secret room, nice. Doing really, really well in the secret room finding at the minute. Excuse me. This out. Wailing Leech. There's another HP up, which I didn't really need, I'll be honest. Honestly, I think I'd kind of be okay with Devil Deals at this point, because I've got a lot of hearts that I could throw away. I love the rework on this guy. Makes the fight way more unique. Can I put you to sleep? Does that work? It did briefly. I know you're going to brimstone me at some point. I'm ready for it. I managed to get a butt bomb out there. I don't even know how I managed that. Okay. All good. No free cash room there. God damn it. I knew you were going to go invincible, you little shit. Oh, bugger. I left before the room was over. It's fine. It's fine. So, I can, what I can do here, by the way, is I can Deus Custodia as the item is held above my head. But if I get something really interesting, like Monstrous Lung, I can save it. May have been a huge mistake here, because my charge time is horrendous. But that's a lot of fun, so I don't mind. Whoops. <laughs> Whoops. I was like, ooh, Ipecac with this. That's so fun. Mm. Didn't think about how bad the charge time would be, and it is bad. Our butt bomb charge time is a lot less. We are going to need some fire rate ups very, very, very shortly. Another morbid heart there. Very, very nice. Good thing is, like, this kills most things. Yeah, this is, this is the worst fire rate I think I've ever had. Oh my god, I let go by accident. This was such a mistake. Why did I do this? I saved this item to myself as well. I'm such a goose. I've goosed it, people. I've goosed it. Oh my god. The I, I, I think I have, like, really high range or something as well, because the shots just fucking go. You need to be... You need to be gone, my good sir. Thank you, Leech, for helping me. Okay. How did that not kill everything in this room? Oh my god. This is rough. Oh my god, I let go before it charged again. This is so rough. This takes so long to charge. It doesn't even kill everything in the goddamn room. Thank god I have butt bombs to augment my damage a little bit here, because fucking hell, this would be brutal without it. Also, where the flipping hell's the boss? It feels like this floor's been going forever. It's pretty hilarious to see all these uh, nukes going off above everything, but... Beautiful. I mean, it is. It's pretty awesome, but yeah, the charge time is definitely going to cause us issues. You all asleep now, fellas? Sleeping with the fishes. Mr. Dolly, pretty good tears up. I, I say that. It's like the tiniest tears up ever. I'm taking Star of the Bottomless Pit as well. What? Like, what the hell's going on with that tier height? Why is it so crazy? Ooh, hello. Hello, fellas. 
Right, we've got enough br broken hearts now. Just stick with this. We're going to be generating two locusts a room, which is pretty good. We'll lose Old Bell. We'll lose Whirling Leech. We'll lose Crucifix. Pretty okay with that. What the hell is going on with my tier height? Like, is it... I, it must be something to do with my range. My range went up and it just got so much worse. Really? Can, can we not with these guys, please? Mini Isaacs, please. Is no I think Nurse Goblin's probably better right now. I don't really know how much better, but it's better. Oh, well, that's kind of interesting. I like the idea of that. Honestly, why with the range? It's so absurd. I just want to hit these goddamn rocks. I, I literally can't. Oh god, I used a Gigabomb by accident. My bad. Whoopsie daisy, I guess. That gave me a fire rate right up. Oh, that's absolutely beautiful. So what you're telling me, game, is I need Brimstone. All will be right if I find Brimstone somehow. That is what you're telling me right now. Which seems obvious, but... I feel like it has to be stated. I can't believe we got a tears up and it still feels this bad. That's a tears up book. I like the idea of that. Only 33% tears though, so that's not going to be great. God. Okay. Try and get the hell out of this place. Don't know where that ghosty came from. I will not question anything right now. I'm just looking for the way out. Show me the door. Cool, didn't even have to fire in that room. Those are the rooms I like. If I don't have to fire, that's a successful room to me. Kind of wish I had these skulls locked in as well. These skulls are doing some work. Lord. Mm. Look at that guy. Look at him go. He has so much momentum, like so much explosive force that you can't even reach the wall he's trying to go towards. That's so funny. We've been to the item room. I think honestly we just go for the boss here. He just fucking disappeared. I have to take this for the chance that tears ups. I got a few. Nice. I got a few. Oh, shit. That's an absolutely huge tears up. It's a flat... It gives you flat stats. But okay. We just... We just increased our tears by four times. We don't need the, caps, the health capsule. That was very, very successful. Like, look, look at our tier right now. Oh, baby. I still wish we didn't have this much fucking range. The range is super depressing, but... Otherwise, I'm reasonably happy with how this is going. Do some of these other rooms now that my charge rate is uh, a little more generous. Oh, that is satisfying as all hell. Yeah, I wish Ipecac didn't do this. The tier height thing is just, it's just ridiculous, isn't it? It's just stupid. No one needs tiers that go that high. The Bibble. I suppose we can use the Bibble to get over here and grab this, which is a High Priestess. Not exactly what I'm looking for, my good sir. But yeah, I can't believe it just gives you flat stats. That's so insanely good for this situation. I want more of those now. Oh my god, as if I could have missed out on a planetarium here. Well, you gotta check your flaws, people. And we get Pluto, that's a Tears Up, and a Shrinking of Us. Um, 
This is a, a, a gamble and a half, but I'm going to deus this, and then I'm going to grab this. Not a great tease up. Good. I did it the right around. Basically, with Saturnus here, we can just walk into a room and just walk into everything. We don't have to worry anymore. We just, we just walk into everything and they all die. Now, our health isn't looking great anymore, but hey, her. It is what it is, Hermbolio. In fact, at this point, I will take this. Right, let's go. But yeah, now now we don't we theoretically don't have to fire at all. We lost our skulls, no. We actually lost a range upgrade. I'm pretty happy about that. Um Okay, there you go. I was gonna say, where are you going? Okay. <laughs> oh, I love this. This is a funky setup right now. I love the immunity to explosives runs. They're always fun. Pop that poop. Pop that poop. Yeah, gotta remember I don't only have to run into enemies, it's just that I can now. I haven't even used my book once yet, oh my god. My book gives me such a pathetic amount of tears. It's literally like not even worth considering using. <laughs> Those open. Even if this thing's really good, I really shouldn't pay effect it. Um. Yeah, it's an extra bomb thing. And honestly, this is probably better for us right now. Probably better. Oh, look, explosive enemies. What am I ever going to do? I should really try and look for the shop here. Oh my lord. I love it. Explosive rain. Explosive rain. Oh bollocks, I got hit by something. Luckily I have a few morbid hearts at the minute, so I can like refill them pretty easily. Oh, bloody bugger off, you guys. Not a fan. Also, not a fan of this. I mean, I got the quarter out of it, which is interesting, but not useful. Right, let's go. Let us goeth to the bosseth. Boss, are you ready? I don't think you're ready for this jelly. I popped that just in case. I knew it was unnecessary. Um, I think we'll just take Light Path here. And let's go. Yeah, this is truly something blessed now. Let's see what we lose. Item we just picked up. Bit of movement speed. Okay, nothing else. Awesome. It's very good stuff for me. Don't even know what died there. Have absolutely no idea. Don't care to find out. Oh, I love this. Runs like this are just so... Like, unique and bizarre. You don't get them very often, so I love them. Looking for a red heart at this point, because I got hit there. I want to refill that morbid heart before I lose it. Morbid heart can take two hits on the wound. This guy's immune to damage for a little while, makes him kind of spooky. 
extra keys are good for the hush fight if we do that, which I think we will. I keep seeing my bombs and I'm like, oh no, get out the way, it's gonna hit me. <laughs> As if I care. One thing I do like about the uh, insane range we have is we can do situations like that where we like fire and it just hits the entire room. Beautiful. Is everything dead? Seems like everything's dead. Nice one. And like anything that tries to chase me, it's like the, I've got a ring of explosions surrounding me. Normally a terrible combination, but when you've got explosive immunity, boy is it spicy. Let me tell you. Boy is it spicy. My god, our flies do so much damage as well, our locusts are just nuts. I guess it's a tears up. Should just take it. Pretty good tears up as well, actually, wow. Uh, right, to the next floor. Don't need more HP. And this floor we lose. Mr. Dolly, how dare you? Uh, Mr. Dolly was a fine one to lose there. Just, it's just nice as well because like normally I'd have to like wait until everything, all these shots like got out of the air before I could safely move around. Otherwise I'd just hit myself with them. But now I can just be like, nah, just get me in there. Put me in, coach man. Just go for it. Give it some welly. Or I can just leave rooms when I feel like it, too. Also rather nice. But that guy didn't even... He didn't even get a chance to do his on-death effect. He just... He uber-died. He's not just dead. He's m &S dead. Making a few specific references that people might not get at the moment. I do that a lot in my videos. Like, how many, how many times do you guys hear me reference something and you're just like what the fuck is he talking about because i do it a lot i reference tv shows that i watch are like more commonly british things that a lot of you might not they might just glide right over your head you might have no idea what the hell i'm talking about i'd be curious to know how often that happens and how many of the the references that i make regularly that you'd like to understand or don't understand i'm sure there's a good few out there Skip that room. Good, good. Yeah, I think we'll do the hush fight. I think we've definitely got the goal to do it. What the heck? We got a miser heart, I think that is. Um, and not much else. Control bomb. Not great results there. Right. The credit card, it's your time to shine. I mean, I guess. Lizzie is some extra fire rate, which I do not mind. Glowing hourglass. Marked. <laughs> now, marked is an interesting one. Um, I think it could be funny, but I'm going to take it. Yeah, pretty funny. Um, I guess I'll just take both of these. Glowing hourglass is eh. Kern head good. Hobbs rotten head good. There we go, we found it. Sadly, nothing of use there, really. Take holy water. Take that. Right, let's go. Might lose a good few of those. I hope I don't lose marks. K 
can't really see where the enemy's tiers are, so forgive me if I get hit a bit here, but it's kind of how it is. Remember, we've got bugger tiers with 44 damage as well. They'll be doing quite, quite a good bit of damage if they manage to stick to him, which I don't actually know if they physically can, I'll be honest. But we'll find out. Either way, he's dying quick. The holy water in there too, why not? We got a few gigabombs actually as well. Why don't we uh, throw a gigabomb in there? See how much that does. Does a decent amount. Now that's a lot of bombs. Getting a little hectic around here. Get another gigabomb for you, just in case. He's going underground like a coward once again. I don't like cowards. Get up here so I can fight you like a man. Or like a blue blob. Are you a man? I don't know. I don't have to classify you as. I don't think we need to gender this amorphous blob of flesh. Dead flesh. I guess it's a male because it's kind of Isaac. I don't know. Who the fuck knows? <laughs> I'm just rambling at this point. Right. Yeah. We're, we're going to lose a lot of shit here. I hope it's not good shit. Let me keep marked at least. We lost the wallet. That's fine. We lost the roll of film. That's fine. We lost the quarter. That's fine. We lost holy water. Okay. I'm pretty happy with all of that. It let me keep marked. Therefore, I am a happy camper. And it was all dead. Do, 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 do. Right, we're out of here. To be fair, again, we can just like bail on every room imaginable if we want to. We probably should. I love the fact that you can bomb straight through those guys. Why isn't this door opening? Is it a mini boss? It's probably a mini boss. Ah. Kill him before he goes invincible. Quick, 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 quick. Yeah. We got angel items as well. I mean, we got stairway, which is intriguing. Don't think I need the pail. Um, curious to see the stairway. Curious to see. Oh, I just got. Double eternal hearts from that token, I didn't mean to. <gasps> I got hit. How dare the game do this to me. Dare it treat me in such a fashion. <clears throat> I just love this with Mark, it's so hilarious. You all get out of here. So just you I need to kill? I think it is, isn't it? It was. Nice. That's that half heart I need to refill my morbid heart. Thank you. I'm blocking myself more than anyone else right now. Hello. Would you like some holy lights of your own? I know you have some normally, but I've got some to return. It's raining bombs, hallelujah. We are able to do Mega Satan here, so I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna go this way. I'd like to do Void, but... We got Stairway, hell yes. I took my goddamn active off me. A cheeky blighter. Oh! This is intriguing. Um... Yes, please. 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 I don't even know how Pop's gonna work with this setup. It's probably not great. Yeah. It's kind of insane. Really? That's what you're gonna give me? Pop 
pop makes this whole thing a lot more confusing. Also, we managed to get an extra key piece, which is weird. We also got a prism, which is weird. Angelic prism's gonna get real wacky for us, I think. Oh lord. <laughs> this has become something quite different than what I was expecting on this floor. This is something else entirely. We'll reach Blue Baby in no time at all, I hope. And uh, show him our eyes. Show him our green, green eyes. Right, if only I could find the right way. There's an, at this point, there's no actual physical way to aim correctly. It just kind of all happens how it happens. We we really have very little influence over what get hit, what's get hit, what gets hit when. We can face in the general direction. That's about the as much as we can help the game. Everything else is random chance, and of course I've gone the wrong way all three times so far. Gotta love that on this floor. It always happens. Dumpy and fast bombs. Why not? I'd like to have got that chest, but using the means I have available, it's not super plausible. There you go, that's better. Three dollar bill, baby! Gotta add that bad boy into the mix. Got to get random tier effects going. Okay, this is just fire wherever you want and hope for the best. Stuff will die, inevitably so. We got nine lives and this is actually pretty good for us, right? Yeah, 0 0.04 extra fire rate increased. Holy hell. Just sit at the door. Wait until it opens and get out of here. Are we out of here? We are out of here. <laughs> what the hell have I done to this game? God damn, the boss is just not not working with us right now, is it? Hello, bicycle boy. I don't want anything to do with you, please. Don't know where you are anymore. Everything is just getting lost in a sea of multicolored shenanigans. Heart, thank you. Here we go, it's boss man. Hey blue baby. How you doing? Don't believe you have much of a chance here, but you can certainly try. Hmm. Certainly try, my guy. The, the only problem is if we do get Void, we, we're going to lose a lot of items. It's not going to be quite this crazy. Right. Let's go do Mr. Mega Satan. See what we can do. Can't remember where the boss room is exactly. I think it's this room here. Yes, it is. Hello, good sir. I am ready to face you. Are you ready to face me? Because I don't believe you are. I don't believe you know what you've gotten yourself into here. It's evident. Actually, that is very evident. I just love the way he enters his next phase, like, immediately. He's like, alright, just bring him out. Just bring him out. Again, not even really trying to aim for anything particular here. It's just happening how it happens. There's a troll bomb there. I was scared of it for a minute until I realized that's a little silly, don't you think, to be scared of a troll bomb? With the situation that we've got going on right now. I feel like that's a little foolish.
You're also dead, my son. I just love that, like, this run can exist in any circumstance, but if you don't have Hurst Hat, it's game over. We got Hurst Hat and it made it all better. Second phase, baby. He managed to get a Brimstone out there, but luckily I was aware. I was ready. That's a nerf from me, sunshine. Right. I stand really close to him. And explode the hell out of his face. We're doing about 10%, maybe 20% of his damage. Now, about 10% of his damage per hit. Unfortunately, he does have a lot of shots here that we can't really do much about. He's down to 50% HP already. Luckily, our ring from uh, our planetarium item does eat up a lot of his shots. At this point, we can't really dodge effectively. Just kind of hoping for the best. And there you go, we've got him. Will we get a Delirium player? We've got to take the opportunity if we get it. Praying altar. Hey, we got the delirium opportunity. Let's see how many items we lose here, because this is going to be a lot. <laughs> well, we kept uh, this, which is great. Stairway. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's pretty much fine. That's definitely fine. Okay, we didn't lose anything important there, really. Um, We don't currently have flight, so I guess yes with you. Um... I'm going to pay you out first before we um, try blowing up the statue. Because I think if we pay you out, you'll drop an angel item. Okay, that didn't really work. Don't know what happened to that guy, but... Ooh, shit. We got Chimera, which is actually really good. We get permanent stat upgrades for like killing bosses and stuff. And of course, there's a fucking load of bosses on this floor. And we also get permanent stat upgrades for each room we beat, I think. We're getting all the stats here. Like, a lot of stats. Like, an unholy amount of stats. I'm hoping mainly in the fire rate department, but we'll see. Biggest issue right now is visibility is going to be very low. <laughs> there ain't much we can do about it. Good. It's mainly pop pop that like causes it to go quite as crazy as it does. Pop pop just goes wild. Bunch of smokers there. Ah, I'd wanna get over to the key. Fuck you. There you go, got it, I got it, I got it. Oh, I don't even need the key. I can fly right over those blocks. So I can't normally. I don't know why I can now. Good. Honestly, the fact that the prism lines up perfectly with our, um... What's it called? Our ring to, like, duplicate the shots is pretty awesome. I'm going to say it's what's allowing me to not fire right now. Because firing is a dangerous activity for us. Most certainly. On three golem trinkets. I guess I'll try it. Damage and shot speed when near fire. Damage when he's close by. Nah. None of those are really up to scratch for us, I don't think. Good. Managed to get hit there, stupid. Beautiful. Cracked Infamy is potentially okay, but I'm not going to take it, just in case. Monetarium Disc, I'll keep that for now. Guess I'll take a Golden Key, just in case something comes across where we need it. Just, like, with Dumpy and everything, I just get in there. Run right into the middle of the room and hope for the best. 
It's something of a, of a beautiful practice, really. Come on, bosses. Reveal yourself to me. And I don't mean that boss there. I mean boss room bosses. Come on. Be real. It's still real to me, damn it. Sometimes I love that when I, like, enter a room and stuff just dies the moment I enter. Because the, the orbitals just hit them. Walked right into that fire. Very easily could have avoided it and just, I guess, chose not to. I don't know what else to tell you. The rainbow poopy. I probably shouldn't blow that up. Damn it, I've already done it. Golden rocks. Crawl space, maybe? Would be good. I mean, yeah, I guess I'll take butt bombs and linger bean. Don't think either do too much for me, but it's not a bad thing. Just adding to the party, I guess. Just quickly check this. Did indeed get small rock. Um, pretty good. We can go and get the ultra secret room real quick if we want. Kind of nice. I hate the noise that Pop Pop makes. It's, it's like satisfying, but also like so fucking repetitive. And a Viper there as well. Right, and then we just use it here, right? Beautiful stuff. And we get a Dark Angel as well. Hello, sir. How are you? All good, all good. And we get the Spirit of Anger, which is pretty good. Small damage up each time certain events occur. We get two Devil Discs, which I'll just pop. That one's Brimstone. That one's also a Brimstone. Devil disc. Okay. Try and use those. Oh my life. That is something quite special. Especially with Pop. Okay. I'd like to fight some bosses while we have this available. Who knows if that's going to happen. Sadly not. Probably because of this guy. Beautiful. That's insane. The double brimstone with this setup. Come on. Give me one boss before this runs out. I, I know it's going to run out as well. It's just upsetting. We'll see what we can do, though. We'll see what we can do. Quickly grab my planetarium disc again, because why not? One minute free trial. Oh, come on, game. Stop with these bullshit rooms with all the stuff in them. Dude, let me out of the door. Where am I? There you go, that's you dead. This you pin. Don't even know what the boss is or where it is. It's a Skolex that's stuck under the ground. Okay. We're getting through him. He is dead. What, what was that result? reward? No! Free trial, how could you leave me? Okay, get game. Can we just chill out with all the explosions for a hot minute? We've lost our brimstones. It's a really sad time for everyone here. Really sad time for everyone here. Come on, boss. Where art thou? Eternal heart there. Thank you. 
still, I don't know how I'm so goddamn awful at finding the boss. I always find Delirium last. Big old damage up, just pump, pumping our numbers up to 70. Easy peasy. Okay, we finally found him. Planetarium disc. Get that in there for some reason. I don't know if that'll be super useful or not, but there you go. Don't actually know, like, how easy it's going to be to beat this guy, because just the sense that this fight is going to make is, is low. There's not going to be a lot we have to grasp onto in terms of watching what's going on. I mean, we're going to kill him quickly. And we do have an okay amount of HP here. I managed to Mars dash into him there. But I think in terms of being able to watch and actually dodge shots, it's the chances are minuscule. I mean, the entire screen is just covered with tears right now. So, wherever, wherever he is, he's getting hit. It just depends on the amount he's getting hit, really, doesn't it? Also, I'm getting hit too. I'm like, not as in like taking damage, but I'm getting knocked around like crazy by these bombs. Ow. Okay, he's down to about quarter health. I've got holy light shots for some reason. Legitimately no idea why. Oh, a three dollar bill, maybe. Probably, definitely three dollar bill. Oh, dude, you transformed to that version of yourself. That's not a good idea. Anyways, this was an absolutely cracking good run. I hope you guys thoroughly enjoyed this one. Isaac is fucking crazy sometimes. It just gets wild. But yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this one. And yeah, let's see what we unlock. Age of Leopard Flesh. Not bad, not bad, not bad. And yeah. I will see you guys in the next one.